you're going to want to stick around to the end of this video where I'm going to show you something really cool and it's one of the things that makes Storyteller such a great tool. Okay, so Storyteller has a plethora of tools that make your pre-production workflow and production workflow really smooth. Let's just look at first the main window for Storyteller. There you can manage and create multiple story projects inside your single Unity project. And then in your project creation area, you can choose between a voiced story, text, or storyboard, or you can mix all three together. What's really great is that at the end of the day, you can make anything in-game interactable using the GameBridge components in Storyteller. And the flexibility of data you export from Storyteller makes it easy for you to do things like this. We took a non-linear story and turned it into a linear story and used it in a text-based chat game. And this is not a basic system because it will support every language that can be supported in Unity. So you can have localized sound effects, voice, and text. And you can dynamically set and replace keywords during gameplay. And not only do your characters have the option of a chain of dialogue, which supports localized text, voice, and sound effect, but now that character can have multiple evolution states. So for every version of that character, there can be a whole range of data that you can set for that character. What's really interesting to most people is the use in-game. And in-game, you have access to a visual scripting component, which is the condition system, which allows you to run just about any kind of function you need to run. And project management is easy, as all you need to do is move a couple nodes around in the timeline and export again, and the game is updated with the new dialogue and interaction information. And now I bet that you did not know that 85% of this video was produced in Storyteller.